How's it going, everybody? This is meteorologist Tori Goshi. It is just about, say, uh, 3.30 on your Friday. Hopefully you all had a great week. We are tracking some light rain showers for today, but the bigger thing we're tracking is uh, the last uh, storm of 2019 is on the docket. That is really two, uh, Sunday night through early Tuesday, and it looks to be mainly rain, though a few of our northern suburbs may see a little bit of some wintry mix. The New Year's Eve forecast, slow to clear and seasonable temperatures as well. So here's the big picture. We'll wrap up the rest of Friday, and high pressure is going to be sliding off the coast. That helps to clear the clouds as we go throughout Friday night into early part of Saturday morning. Saturday looks to be a sunny, beautiful day with a light north wind. Clouds do filter in early Sunday. Sunday does look to be dry during the daylight hours, but you notice all that green on the map. That is the rain ahead of our next storm system that will be coming in uh, likely between 6 and 8 o'clock on your Sunday. You watch it closely and you notice that there is a fine line of uh, wintry mix there in the pink. That is like the rain snow line. And you can see it kind of blends into northern Rhode Island, Cumberland, Woonsocket, North Smithfield, all the way over to Barville, Gloucester in the northwestern suburbs uh, there in Foster and Situate could see a light mix. So essentially, if you live north of 295, there is a possibility you may see a light wintry mix as we head throughout uh, uh, Sunday night into the day on Monday. Anybody that has travel plans flying out of Logan, out of Providence, Hartford, things may be a little tricky on your Monday, so do pay attention uh, to the forecast there closely. Uh, rain mostly for this event. Here's a look at our rainfall forecast. You can see it's almost a uniform uh, one to about one and a half inches of rain across uh, much of southern New England. Uh, so, uh, unfortunately, if this was snow, you take a snow to liquid ratio and you generally get maybe between eight to 10 inches per inch you would be looking at maybe close to over 15 inches of snow in some locations. So if you are a snow lover and wanting to see some white snow on the ground, unfortunately, this is not your storm. Okay, let's wrap up the rest of your Friday. Uh, temperatures were mild today, courtesy of a southerly wind component. Heading into the overnight hours, temperatures slowly dropped down to about the middle part of the 30s for most of us, lower 30s in northwestern Rhode Island. Uh, heading throughout your day tomorrow, things are looking rather comfortable. Temperatures climbing into the low 40s in Pasco, 45 in Providence, 46 in Newport. Westerly wind throughout your day. Saturday night to early Sunday, clear skies do continue. So the forecast for this evening calls for those clouds to continue to clear can't rule out a few more isolated really just light showers between say now and nine o'clock after nine we're really starting to dissipate those clouds and clear things right on out your forecast for tomorrow starts off with sunshine temperatures climbing quickly to near 40 by almost 10 nearing the mid 40s by one and then slowly falling as we head into the overnight hour so lots to talk about as we head into the last weekend of 2019 We'll have a lot more coming up starting live at 5. We'll see you then.